All right, this is an Ames Power Pure Sign Power Inverter, and this is a 1500 watt one. So this will handle uh, electrical devices that have very uh, low power uh, needs. Uh, you could uh, run the refrigerator in your house, some other small circuits with that. Uh, it has a peak uh, power availability of 3000 watts. So in a pinch, it would go up to 3000 for a short time. Uh, right now, this is hooked into my golf cart, and so this it converts the 48 volts of DC power into 110 volts of AC power, which is what your house electrical is going to be like. So around 110 to 120 volts in our houses with the power that comes in from SCE. So if that power was to go down, this would be a way to power devices in your home uh, using the battery power in your golf cart. Depending on how much load there is, that might last for quite a few hours. You might get a day out of it or more. Uh, and if there was high drain, it may uh, use that up quicker. But this would let you have uh, quiet, uh, clean power without having to have a generator, storing of gasoline and all of that. So this is, a, this is a nice way to go on that. You'll see the cord coming out the right side here. That cord is going over to a, a manual switch that uh, will power up circuits in my house and I have a separate video that covers that. And uh, right now, this is running. It has uh, 120 volts that it's putting out, and uh, it'll do 1,500 watts. So I had it switched over, and it was powering up the kitchen in our house just a few minutes ago. So this is a great way to go if you're looking for emergency backup power. The pure sign power is very important, so the pure sign part of that means that this will power computers and other electronic devices that are very sensitive to the input power. If you get yourself an inexpensive inverter that is not pure sign, that's modified sign or something like that, then you may have problems running electrical devices on that that have computers involved.